Hey guys, how's it going? So today what I'm going to talk about is some of the good and bad things about having a dog maybe in a survival situation or an emergency. Okay, so first I'm going to talk about some of the not so good things about having a dog in a survival situation or emergency and then I'll talk about some of the better things about having them. So let's see, what things could not help you in a survival situation if you had a dog? Okay, one of them could be is maybe if your dog barks a lot, that could give out your situation, I, I mean, not your situation, that could give out your location. If you're maybe trying to hide or something and you have a dog and they like to bark a lot, that's not gonna help you out because maybe you're trying to hide and if they bark a lot, then other people who are trying to survive or something, they could find you. So that's one of the bad things about having a dog if you're trying to be stealthy. Another thing could be is that's another mouth to feed. So if you're hunting food, you're gonna have to feed your dog. Dogs can hunt. But if they always like maybe live in a house or something and you always feed them, then they're not going to be used to hunting. So yeah, they, might, they might know how to catch their own food, but some dogs might, they might not be the best at hunting. I have a boxer and they're actually pretty good at catching iguanas, surprisingly. They like just like somehow catch iguanas that climb up and down trees. So yeah, depending on what kind of dog you have, hunting and well, you'll have to feed your dog. And, but if they can hunt, that could be a good thing. Okay, another thing that isn't so good. If your dog isn't trained, then they might run around, they could get hurt, and then you might have to take care of them. And like if your dog is trained and you've, you've trained your dog to like stay by you and to be quiet and not to just like chase after any noise that they hear, then that's gonna be a lot better. Then if your dog, if you, if your dog just like doesn't know and likes to just like chase random noises and stuff, that won't be so good because that'll make noise and you could be found by other people. And so depending on if you're trying to be stealthy or not, these could be good or bad. A lot of the time you're gonna to wanna to be stealthy when you're surviving or an emergency, because usually maybe you're out doing something and then there's an emergency and you need to get back to your home or your bug out location and you kinda of wanna do it quietly without tons of people noticing you. They can get injured and they, you, if, if you're somewhere where there's not lots of water, then you're gonna to have to carry water for them and stuff. They'll probably have to carry a little bit of food for them because if, if they can't, if they don't, if you guys, if you don't find food immediately, you need to have some sort of food for your dog. I'm just doing this off the top of my head. Uh, okay, we're gonna start doing things that are good about having a dog. Okay, good things about having a dog or pet. We'll just say dog. Uh, well, if they know how to hunt, like I said before, then that could be good because if you get injured or something and you're not able to hunt for food or fish, then your dog could probably, could maybe save your life if, you, if your dog knows how to hunt. Like maybe your dog catches a rabbit or an iguana or something, and that could save your life because there you have some meat to eat and if you're like, if you like break your leg or you're hurt really bad, then that could save your life. Uh, another good thing about having a dog is they can smell and hear a lot better than humans. And they can also just like, just like sense. So like they can hear stuff like sometimes at night when maybe you're sleepy and you're like completely passed out. Dogs are like asleep, but they like still hear everything. So if they hear maybe like a noise or like they hear someone walking, then they could, they, they'll hear it and they could get up and they might wake you up. So that could save your life too because they'll hear noises that you wouldn't hear when you're sleeping. And they can also smell really good. So they can also, they can find and smell stuff. They can smell and hear a lot better than humans. Right, Malaya? Right, you can smell and hear a lot better than me. I like to smell food. They can smell and hear a lot better than humans. So they can be better at hunting. They could be better at hunting, but also maybe not if they make a lot of noise. But like at nighttime or something, if they hear or smell something that's kind of weird or maybe they think it's like suspicious, then they, if they know, they could wake you up and maybe save your life again. They, they could save your life a lot of the time. And another good thing about having a dog is maybe if you are hunting and your dog is trained to like help you hunt, sometimes if, like if they smell something or they hear something, or sometimes they even see stuff that you don't see, like they'll see something like move, like an animal because of their instincts and that you might not notice, then they could be, they'll, they'll like get down like, and like look at that spot and then that could maybe like you might like figure out that there's like an animal there like camouflaged but your dog saw the animal so then you would know that it's there and you could hunt it so there's good and bad things about having a dog right Hansi right Hannah yes there's good and bad things but um, for depending for what for where you live there might be more good things or bad things about having a dog like here in the jungle they'll they're they're better because they can hunt so they can hunt so if they can hunt pretty good, they could catch food for themselves as well as for you. And they have, it's like having another set of eyes and ears. So instead of just your, your eyes looking around for like hunting or looking for food or something, 
or looking for like other people maybe trying to get your stuff or something, then your dog is list hearing, will hear other noises and also see, see if they see something move or they see someone come. And another good thing about having a dog is if, if, they, if they're trained or whether or if they're maybe just like they kind of know, they could, pr they could protect you like if there's maybe someone tries to attack you and like steal your bag full of supplies and your dog might know to like maybe attack them and they could let, they a dog, well, depending what kind of dog, they can bite pretty hard like a pit bull will bite pretty hard and they could like totally stop someone from taking all your stuff if they like attack the person and then you're able to get up and then attack the person. So they could save your life there again and save you from losing all your supplies. And another good thing about having a dog is they keep you company. So if it may be if you survive and you have like a family, then you'll always have company. But if you survive and you survive alone or you adventure alone or whatever, having a dog is keeping you company. So sometimes having like some, a, a dog will like keep you happy because they're always happy. They're always happy to see you. They're always, mo most pretty much always, they're happy to see you and they never like lie to you and stuff. So that's pretty cool. So those are all the goods and bads things that I thought about, that I just thought about of, of having a dog in an emergency or survival situation. Please let me know in the comments if you have any other ideas of good and bad things about having a dog or a pet in an emergency. I hope you enjoyed. Personally, most of the time, I would rather have a dog because they have better instincts than humans. They're good at hunting most of the time. Sometimes they can find water better than humans from instincts. They're pretty cool. They have lots of cool instincts. Wish humans had cool instincts like that. I would rather have a dog most of the time, unless it was maybe like in the city where I had to survive. Please let me know in the comments, because I would love to hear if you have any ideas of good and bad or bad things about having a dog or pet. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I think dogs are awesome. Don't forget to subscribe for more awesome adventuring, survival, surfing, skating, uh, lots of cool stuff, vlogs, videos. And uh, yeah, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. This is Malaya. Da 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 ba, 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 ba. Woohoo! She's a little boxer.